up guys and welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I'm going to be sharing with you a Louis Vuitton Never Full Dupe. So if you've always wanted this bag, but you were looking for something a lot more budget friendly, then this might be the bag for you. So if you'd like to see my review of this bag, then just keep watching because we're gonna get started. All right, you guys, so this is the Chrissy Tote from Handbag Crave. Look at how similar this is to the Never Full MM. I actually have a Never Full MM, so I will do a little bit of comparison for you guys later on in the video, but let's start by looking at the exterior of this bag. It basically looks identical to a Louis Vuitton Never Full, aside from missing the logos, because again, I want to reiterate that this is a dupe and not a replica of any kind. So this bag is not pretending to be Louis Vuitton, it's just in inspired by the Neverfull. So this is their beige check shade. They also do have it in brown as well. I myself already have the brown Louis Vuitton Neverfull, so I opted for this beige color since I don't have it. And it really does look very, very similar to a Louis Vuitton, even down to the coloring of the checks. Really impressed by that. Um, it even has this like yellowy stitching that Louis Vuitton's known for, as well as the red coloring on the handles and and also has the side straps here to kind of cinch the bag in if you want to make it a little bit um, smaller because the great thing about the Neverfull bags is that you can actually make them a little bit more boxy, a little smaller for day-to-day -day use. What I love about these bags is that they are perfect for traveling. They're a really, really great size. Whether you're driving somewhere or flying, I myself take my Neverfull every single time I fly because I'm able to put my laptop inside. I'm able to put all of my chargers if I bring my camera, I bring my makeup and skincare in there because in case I have to check a bag, I wanna make sure that I have my necessities all in one bag for me and then I feel really comfortable with whatever happens to my luggage because we all know sometimes that happens and things get lost. So it's nice to have a bag that fits everything, hence the name of the Neverfull. So if you've been looking for a Neverfull bag, this might be the one for you because this comes in at just under 85 US dollars compared to, I think the Neverfull has been raised to almost $1,500. That is a lot of money, and if you just don't want to invest in something like that, then this might be the way to go. Another really great thing about this bag is that if you use my code MLO5 at checkout, you can get $15 off your first purchase from Handbag Crave when you spend $120 or more. They have a lot more than just this bag. They have bag organizing inserts, they have wallets, they have tons of other handbags. So if this one really isn't up to your standards or you want something a little bit different, they have a really great variety to check out. Let me share with you also that this bag not only comes with the tote, but inside it comes with a little pouch attached as well. And my Neverfull didn't come with one, so this is really cool that you're not only getting the tote bag, but you're also getting a pouch that can disconnect. You just kind of unclasp it. I think this is called like a lobster claw clasp. What I like about this is that then you can clasp it to itself and then it becomes a little wristlet. So if you want to take this bag out on a date night, a little bit more convenient and you're not taking this whole tote bag with you, then this makes it really easy. And I especially love that for travel because sometimes we only bring one bag when we travel and then we're stuck with this giant tote when we're walking around and we really need something that's a little bit easier to walk around with. So this can fit your phone, your wallet, your key, Keys, all of that so everything that's really important is all right here and that's also what I love about traveling with this is that if I do attach this to the inside of the bag then I know where all my important stuff is so if I'm going through security or whatever and I need to like pull out my ID or something I know it's right there so let's go back to the exterior of this bag I mentioned it has these little straps here so I believe I'm not really sure how to um, I've never made my Louis Vuitton bag smaller um, but I believe Leave, you can just like cinch in the straps. So here's now what it looks like with it all uh, cinched in together. You can just kind of like throw these straps, kind of like let them hang on the interior of the bag. And now you have a bag that works for day-to-day -day use as well if you didn't want to carry around this huge 
tote. So this bag honestly is really, really versatile, can be used for a lot of different things. Um, but all in all, I'm very impressed with the quality. So if you're wondering what this bag is made out of, the entire like exterior of the bag, I believe even including the straps because they don't mention on the website anything different, it's all a PVC outer shell. And then the inside is a polyester lining, which we will get into. Um, I also believe that the Louis Vuitton Neverfull is not 100% leather either. It's also a canvas monogram print and then it does have cowhide um, leather straps and lining so that makes the difference. But let's look inside of the bag so you guys can see. So the interior is very similar to the Louis Vuitton Neverfull. It has this really beautiful striped textile interior and again it's all made of polyester. Um, it even has the same free-flowing pocket here that the Louis Vuitton Neverfull has but of course this says handbag crave so again not pretending to be Louis Vuitton just inspired by. So I like this big pocket because again if you decide you don't want to take your little clutch or what do you want to call that like little pochette thing with you um, you can put your phone your keys everything important right here because again it is all just very open on the inside so very very similar it closes the same way as a Neverfull does it has the clasp there to keep everything inside obviously there's no zip so if you want something that's super secure and zipped this might not be the bag for you um, that is one thing that could bother people. I know sometimes if my bag is overly full and it spills over, that is kind of a problem. But for the most part, I don't find any issues when I'm traveling with this bag. So for those of you who want to see a comparison, I know this isn't the same color, but this is the Louis Vuitton Never Full. So you can see the size is almost identical. This is the MM. I'm going to guarantee that they based this bag off the MM size, which is kind of like the medium size. I find this bag to be perfect for travel. I think anything bigger would have been way, way, way too big so I think this is the perfect tote size but you can see very similar design here it has those little cinchy side pieces um, one thing I'll note is that these straps compared to this bag are thicker, but again, I think that's due to it being cowhide leather and this not being leather. So it's really tough to get them both on screen for you guys, but you can see how similar the designs are. I mean, if you were to just like give it a quick glance, you would immediately probably say, oh, that looks just like a Louis Vuitton. Now, somebody who knows that the Louis Vuitton logo is in some of these squares, they might look at your bag and be like, oh, that's a fake, but honestly, who cares? We're not trying to fool anybody here. We just love the look and style. But I really, really love this bag and I want to share with you guys some up close details and also share with you just sort of how it looks on my body. I know some people are afraid to get tote bags based on their height. So for reference, I am 5'7". So I wanna give you guys a little idea of what this bag looks like on my body. Okay, so here's a better comparison of the Neverfull versus the Chrissy Tote. You can see they are very similar in shape and size. And honestly, from far away, it is hard to tell that the Chrissy Tote isn't even a Louis Vuitton bag, so it makes it for a really great dupe. And so for reference, again, like I said, I am 5'7", so this is what the bag looks like. I've always preferred this size and shape of bag to wear as an everyday bag. So while it works really well for travel, it also works as a very comfortable everyday bag, as you can see. It's not too thick or tough to wear. It's soft from the get-go. So here's sort of what it looks like on my body. And here's a little up close view to see the yellow stitching that is very signature with Louis Vuitton as well as that red lining. So honestly, I just think this is pretty spot on for a dupe without having the Louis Vuitton logos all over it. The interior is very, very similar. Again, here's a nice up close view with that really convenient pocket inside of the bag to keep all of your important belongings. And here's what it looks like all closed up for reference if you wanted a better view. Now this is what it looks like all cinched up at the sides there. Obviously the you can tuck that little string hanging off on the side or clasp it in to make it more convenient for you but a really great everyday use size bag if you want to make it a little bit smaller. Here's an up close view of the clutch here. You can see that I can unclasp it, hook it to the bag or whatever you want to do with it. Honestly, it's up to you, but I love that it is able to be made into a clutch. And here is what the interior looks like. It also matches the interior of the tote as well, but this is a really great piece if you want to use for date nights or going out or whatever it is that you want to use it for. 
All right, you guys, so that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this fun review. I'm going to have everything linked down below in the bottom, and don't forget to use my code MLO5 if you're interested in getting this bag. You can get $15 off your first $120 or more purchase from handbagcrave.com. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I will see you guys next time. Mm -hmm.